Let's continue Tears of the Kingdom. If you're watching later on YouTube. As always, thanks for tuning in. Hope you have been enjoying clickety click click buttons, something like that. <laughs> okay, we've arrived at the desolate Lost Woods, which is mildly depressing. <laughs> the uh the Koroks at the moment. Yeah. I guess I have to figure out what's going on. I mean, I would imagine it's the same. The music is very eerie as well, just... Has similar vibes, it's just... Oh, okay, it doesn't even let me... Wow. That's a problem. Why is it still doing this? <laughs> My stomach is not well. Ah. Uh... sense. Yeah, the rabbit hole that I did not want to go down last time. But doesn't this go to the depths? Okay, no, but we're inside the tree, so this is different. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Trying different things here. Seeing what works, seeing what doesn't. You know what also works? Just scorched earth policy. Good defense should be fine. Um, let's go with this the weird looking sword. Okay, <laughs> not effective. Because 
Can you ask a stupid question? Sure. You did it. Thank you so much, Mr. Hero. The great Deku Tree is waiting for you in the Korok Forest. Oh, I can't. No, but. Oh, okay, I was going to say. It's not going to let me pick up the stuff. I want to pick up the stuff. I wonder if Closer chose numbers. Why are there two? What do you mean? On the closer Oh, the thirty-two. Yeah, I just noticed that. What is that? I would assume that's the combined total. That my total armor currently is thirty-two because twelve, twelve plus eight, that's thirty-two. Now it's twenty-four. Now it's thirty-two. I think the, the number on the right is just your total armor value. With all your clothing combined. By the looks of it. Yeah, I don't think that was a dumb question. I think... It's not exactly clear. Because it's kind of... If we look at it, it's kind of in the same box as the clothing item, which is a bit dumb. Like, if they wanted to show the total, it should really be underneath or above where the set bonus thing is, or the temperature dial because that's like global shit it is a bit weird that it's in the box of the actual description of the armor piece bad ui design <laughs> oh you're here Oh, the forest is back to no normal. Really, it was just the stomach. That was it. Okay, well, I'm happy. Hmm? Ah, so it is you. I must apologize. I am still quite groggy, as though I am awakening from a bad dream. You rid me of that unpleasantness deep within me. Yes, you went to great trouble to restore me. Thank you. It has been some time since we last spoke. Have you been well? Hmm, yes, the last time we spoke. That was when you came here with the princess to retrieve the Master Sword. Oh. It is good to see you, Princess Zelda of Hyrule, and Link, Keeper of the Master Sword. Your blade has been fully restored. Go on then, Link. Try it once more. Great Deku Tree, thank you so much. <laughs> Oh, there is no need for thanks. I merely watched over its renewal. It is amazing that a sword can heal itself, no matter how badly damaged it becomes. It can do more than heal. The sword will continue to gain strength if bathed in sacred power. The stronger that power, the more powerful the sword becomes. 
Hmm. The potential of this fable blade may well be limitless. Truly the work of a goddess. A sword that grows ever stronger. Until it shatters. The master sword. But the sword, it would seem that you no longer wield it. Where has it gone? What is this then? You do not know where the master sword is? I see, yet I can sense it even now. There can be no mistake. Oh, no shit. It is here, really? It's just gonna straight up reveal it. It's moving. In the sky, I feel the master sword's presence strong. It's the fucking dragon, isn't it? The Master Sword seems to be moving. You may need to be resourceful to reach the sword, but you must find a way. Surely the Master Sword is away awaiting you, just as you are seeking it. <laughs> okay. Well, we got some shrines to do here before we go do that. Um, I should also climb the tree. It's gonna be cold this weekend. <laughs> it's just weather warnings say it, talking about thunderstorms and stuff. Oh, okay, how cold is it gonna be? It's gonna be cold. Nobody wants to play. Mm, did I do it? Did I hide things well enough? Oh, Mr. Hero, it's you. You see, I wanted to play with everyone by making them hunt for treasure, so I hid stuff around the Great Deku Tree. But I want to make sure I hid things well enough, so I need someone to test it out. I don't want to ruin it for Koroks. See? I'll test it. Yay, since it's for the other Koroks, you're the only one who can help me with this, so thanks. The first two hidden treasures are a Forest Dweller Sword and a Forest Dweller Spear. I hid them higher than the Deku Tree's face. If you can find them, bring them to me. Yeah, I mean, hoodie blanket. That's that's what I'm gonna be in. Oh. Well, there's one. Man. Keep forgetting to get pancake mix. <laughs> it's just I'm, I'm, I never get it. So it's, it's just when I go there, it's I, just, I don't know. When I go shopping, I kind of want to get out of the shopping center as quick as possible. So I'm very... very procedural when it comes to going to buy shit. It's just, okay. In and out, I know I know the store that I'm going to, I know what I'm getting. And just get out of there as quick as possible. So the thought of just the, the pancake stuff just... Afterwards, I'm like, ah, oh, fuck, I forgot. <laughs> I don't want this to kick me out. 
Did I get more dino nuggets? Nah. I mean, I think I'm fine. They were good, but I, I don't want to make them that regular of a thing. As good as they are, they are a little unhealthy. Just a little bit. So it's set above the tree's face, which I guess is here. Yeah. Crap. Yeah, so it can't be below here. Yeah. I did get, uh, like, four bags of my favorite potato chips, because they... They were on special, and by that I mean they were, like, the regular price they were last year, which is... It's the lowest I've seen them in the last seven months, so... I did stock up on that. Do I want to send the back? If there was teleportation technology, you know I would. <laughs> It cost me three dollars to get the bag of chips. It'll cost me twenty to send it. It's just man. I think because of COVID as well, it's just become insane to just send anything overseas now. I mean, at that point, it's honestly easy to just go to a specialty store and just buy it. Like, I'll go look for an American bag of chips and you can look for an Australian one. I wish I was joking, but like, oh, there it is. That is most likely the cost of shipping. It's it's ridiculous. I guess I don't need two axes. Let's just put this down. Okay, I found them. Yes. Was it hard? Yeah, it was a little. Thank you, Mr. Hero. This is useful info. You can keep what you found as a gift. Ah, There's more than just one simple round to this treasure hunt. That's right, time for round two. Next, find me the shield. Hidden in the Deku tree, but below the face. It's not hidden on the ground or in his navel. Not on the ground. Okay. For a second there, I thought that was going to be a Korok. Below the face, not on the ground, not in the navel, so... Along one of these branches, most likely. Cool Ranch Doritos once. Because we were curious and bought them from a specialty store that sold American stuff. 
Because they stopped selling Pop-Tarts in Australia. Like, it's kind of hard to find. Like, you can find them, but typically you'll only find one flavor. We don't have Pop-Tarts. Well, because they were kind of marketed as breakfast food and just bad for children, I guess. That's kind of the reason why it's just like... We didn't want kids eating that shit as a substitute for like a real breakfast. Because they start, they started getting rid of um, the ones that were less intense on the sugar, and they were only having the ones that were just like insane on the sugar levels. That's why, yeah, I, I'm not a fan of pop tarts. I have to be in the mood. Me and sweet stuff is just, it's rare. The ones that I liked were the... They had these just apple cinnamon ones and they weren't intense in sugar. I tried one of these ones that was like... I forgot what it was, but it, it had icing on it and it had sprinkles and man... I couldn't eat half of it. It just felt overwhelming. Hot fudge sundae. Yeah, probably too sweet for me. I'm more of a, a salty snack person. If I'm having something sweet, it'll generally be with just coffee. So don't have sugar in the coffee and then whatever I'm having, just have that as a, a way to sweeten, I guess. I mean, blueberry I think would be alright. But probably still a bit sweet. You can. Fu it's not like you. Okay, when I say they stopped selling them, I meant at like the two big supermarket chains that are like available at about ninety percent of the country, right? But like there are smaller stores that carry them on a regular basis. Um, but, you know, you have to drive a little bit, like maybe 20, 30 minutes. And they're reasonably priced. They're not as cheap as they used to be, but they're not stupidly expensive either, so... You can find them, it's just they're not as readily available as they used to be. What about goldfish and cheese? That's Yeah, we have those find those more than Pop-Tarts. Not a globally available thing, but you can find them. Okay, I've been looking along these tree branches. It's the part where it says it's not on the ground. I think I'm hyper-focusing on these branches a little. But I mean, I could be on- I could be on the ground, but then it could be, say, resting on a rock, and that's technically not the ground. I think the place it definitely ruled out was the navel, so let's just not look in here. I think the only American snacks that I have yet to try are the ones that are kind of logistically impossible to get to Australia <laughs> without paying for a freezing unit. I mean, there might be a few others, but 
one that I keep hearing about are just hot pockets. And we have pizza pockets, but I've been told that's not the same thing, so... You know what? It might be in the mouth of one of these things. Hang on, what does this say? Climb... Oh, yeah. The exit is here this time. That's a great change. That is a fantastic change. I hated where the exit was in Breath of the Wild. I would always run past it. You know what else? I've no I just noticed this as well. The frame rate in the forest... It's not going to shit. Like, it's not struggling at all. So whatever they've done, I mean, I would assume they just removed a bunch of stuff. But it's, it's pretty smooth here. It would struggle when you would get to this forest. Is the shield <laughs> not on the ground? Not in the navel. <laughs> Can't go past it. We'll look at that in a minute. Where? We've been running around in a circle. It's on the tree. I guess it's got to look. I feel like I've, I have walked. I've been walking along all these branches. <laughs> Said not in the navel, so... I bet I've walked past it a bunch of times. Doesn't stand out well. I have a, I have one of the shields on me. Can I just lie to him and say that I have the shield when I don't? Yeah, here, yeah, this is the shield you had. Yeah, this is the one. I don't know. I mean, I have a shield. I would imagine, no. That it 
detects if I have picked up the shield. been looking and I, I just I feel like I've walked around now that's like a full lap I don't see it wait for the internal screaming as I've probably walked past this a bunch of times already I'm not going to like the answer to this, am I? <laughs> well, at least it's not raining. Can it rain in this forest even? I don't think it can. Can't say I've ever seen it do that. This one's either I'm not getting it or it's extremely well hidden. Okay, that was silly of me to do that. I wish the tree was more animated. Like right now, this should be tickling. Outside of the dialogue, it doesn't really have any life to it.
Oh man. I'm gonna see if I can pull him. Let's see what it says. found it, but it's like, oh, you found the shield. Um. The, thanks. Um, stash is full. Oh, both stash, right. I'll take it. <laughs> it's like a little bit of guilt because such a like happy little Korok and I just lied to him. But I, I looked, I walked around. I have no idea where the fuck this shield is. I'm not going to waste an hour looking for a shield. I would laugh if I if I find it right now. Like in the next in the next few seconds. I know, uh, like a, a comedic effect, I kind of want to look, but... Alright, it's fine. They need help. Some of the Koroks have had stuff on their minds lately. Follow the lights in the forest. Come across different Koroks and need help. Alright. You want to see? What do you want to see? Thanks for making the Korok for us normal again. Do you have a minute, Mr. Hero? I've got something I'd like to ask you. Sure. Yeah. Really? Thank you, Mr. Hero. You see, I have a friend who says they saw a big, whirly circle. They saw it in an area of water. Even if it's real, I want to see it myself. A picture will do. It's too dangerous to leave here. A whirlpool. Okay. Um, that's easy. I'm gonna do that right now. Um, there's two, really. I think the easiest one is probably here, because we get high ground, so we teleport to here. We'll be back. I'm so glad I hung on to that shield. <laughs> Oh man, I can only imagine what it would have been like if I had to look for that thing. Uh, it's okay. Uh, I guess I can swap armor again since we're not in the underground. I got a picture from here. Almost, almost. Just need to move slightly. the forest.
think just clicked. Hold on. I thought it might be here, because this is technically above ground. Is there another one of these? There is. Okay, hang on. Whoops. I don't know why I'm still looking for this thing. So this is it. It's so neat, but I feel dizzy from looking at it. Thank you, Mr. Hero. So, there really was a big whirly thing. But you know, that friend of mine, they told me something else. Something shocking. They said there's more than just... There's also this big, swirly sand circle, too. Oh, I won't be able to do that yet. Later, I guess. Hey, now going past here. Oh, you're a Hylian. Well, since you're not a Korok, I guess I don't need to stop you. There's this thing beyond here that I can't stop thinking about. I keep wanting to go check it out again. Yeah. Another thing that showed up in the Korok, Korok forest, I saw something similar to that, but it looked kind of different. Yeah. But when I tried to go back to it, there were a bunch of monsters coming out of the woodwork. Tree monsters and bone monsters. So I'm keeping guard to warn the other Koroks because it's real dangerous. Yeah. But... I'm not go about to stop any Hylians who are feeling brave. Just be careful. Oh, and the flowers are to keep you from getting lost, so don't go picking them. None shall pass, question mark. Okay. Okay, I should use a... I'm gonna make another weapon. Because I don't want to waste that one. I'm gonna go for the Master Sword. Uh, I don't know yet. Maybe. Where are my other horns? These ones. That'll do. It's like an average weapon. Alright. I just don't want to overcommit a good weapon. Oh, so it's just skeletons all the way. Okay, I feel- this- this is ridiculous. I feel like for- this is just gonna take an eternity. I feel like for this...
Please don't say purify. No, it's seek the crystal, okay. Ooh, it's a talus fight. Okay. Um. Yeah, I guess this will do. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> oh, okay. Ha! <laughs> I didn't know you could do that. Okay, it works. That's cool. Yeah, okay. Well. That was, uh... Huh. That's pretty easy. Hey. I was expecting more out of this one. Hey, I was able to come here again thanks to you. I actually secretly followed you. I was a little scared of the monsters, but I managed because of you. But it seems like it's shaped differently than what I saw before. I wonder who moved such a big boulder. How strange. Okay. I didn't kill anything, so, you know. I'm not sure how he followed. I guess... Snuck. <laughs> Diamond. is that now though I mean approaching 120 
Let's see, now I can pick this stuff. Because I'm not coming back here. And I need more of these, so if they said not to pick the flowers... I'm gonna be like, nah, I'm picking these flowers. I need more of them. To upgrade my sneaky sneak. I just won't pick the one closest to the Korok that told me not to. There we go. Loophole. No, it's gone. I'm taking it anyway. One. Another stone escort. Yeah. Isn't the color of the stone so pretty? I found it myself. Ah, uh, you can't have it. No, no, I found it. Hmm? But if you do something with me, maybe I'll consider it. What? Okay, the thing is I love golden apples, and this stone is pretty rare, but I can't really eat. See, five golden apples. Wow. Here you go. <laughs> that was sick. Alright, well. It's half of it done. Oh. Scratch that. <laughs> it's done. Already worthy. Love that for me. I wonder if the game kind of thinks, just maybe, that players will head here sooner rather than later. I don't know. Just, just maybe. That's fine. Hey, Lolo, how's it going, dude? How's things? Things in Diablo 4 lately. Yeah, I've been playing as well. What's, uh, what level are you currently? Uh, I guess I don't need a second one of these. Fifty something. 
I think I, I just barely hit 50. Like, I'm about to hit 51. But I've been taking the axe kind of slowly. Like, I just finished Act 2, but I'm going through and... Getting side quests and map coverage and all that fun stuff, so... I haven't finished the campaign yet. A little bit ahead of me. What class are you playing? Okay, I would assume there's one more, maybe? Or two? I can't remember how many there are. Been doing Frost Sorceress. Oh man, don't say those words. <laughs> I, I've been playing um, a lightning sorceress on the side, and every single thing I've gotten has been for a frost sorceress. Just, ugh, I've been cursed. Just, it wants me to play frost. Uh, but my main is a is a barb, so that's been going well at least. Dude, it's hard. How to fire mage in mine when you started. Yeah. So I'm I'm going shock and uh, conjuration. So I have three conjuration spells and then shock. So the idea is uh, I get skills that can trigger more conjurations and with that, that increases my damage. So it's kind of fun because it's like a multi-element build. I'm not sure how viable it is later, but so far it's been working. this one. I guess I haven't gone to this one yet, so what is this one? It's been a while, so maybe I should see how it's going over there. Over there? Up ahead there's a special place, just to, just for Mecca. In the forest there's a wide open space, and right in the middle there's a green swirl. And you can see a floating island in the sky from there. Mecca loves the place. Oh, but since it's covered in lost fog, only Koroks can go in there, so you can't come with me. But, I'll tell you where to find it. Could you show me a map? Oh. It's there. You can see an island floating in the sky from there. I wonder if you, you can see it. Okay. This is different. But yeah, th 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 there's been multiple times where... It's just been a case of, well, I feel like the game is just saying, yeah, hey, you know how you picked a melee class? Fuck you. <laughs> just, I just get destroyed. Okay, uh, let's just zoom out. Well, I mean... Yeah, my main is a Bob. I'm doing um a hammer build, which is a lot of fun. It's just I think solo play is, is sometimes suffering. There are times when the build works extremely well. And I'm just able to just take out a strong enemy pretty quickly. But then there are other times where it's just enemies that are kiting me constantly and it, it just it sucks but I guess it is what it is depending on how this goes I was gonna probably play it a bit later just getting some quality time in with this Okay, so where... 
Oh, there. Should run around together at some point. Uh, I mean, what what are you up to currently? Have you uh, completed the campaign yet? Because one thing I was going to do was I was going to run some dungeons just to get more aspects. Um, also for completion's sake, because it does offer something later. Okay, well it was just diving. I thought that wasn't gonna work given how I tried to get into the Lost Woods the first time around. Kind of powered through the campaign because some of your friends are absolute crackheads. <laughs> but I mean, powering through the campaign is just getting through the content, but you didn't do side quests and that kind of stuff, so. I mean, that's fair. I'm taking my time with it. One of them beat the game within a couple of days before the full release even happened. But they just went through campaign, right? Like, they didn't bother with side quests or... Exploration or Lilith Shrines. Because I've been trying to get everything in the area before moving on. Like, I would imagine that's just... Flat out just running to the campaign, trying to get to 50 as soon as possible. Because that's where the Paragon board stuff starts. Pretty much, they had to have, right? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, that's fine and everything. It's just, there's, there's no real reason to rush to that right now, because it's not like this, the ladder or the season or whatever they're going to call it has started. It's just, it's just campaign. So, I'm experiencing side quests and finding stuff, and it's been fun. But also, just from a VOD perspective, I guess having a playthrough that walks through stuff slowly. Uh, okay, that's that one done. These have been a lot easier than Breath of the Wild's equivalent ones. Okay, are there any more? I mean, it almost looks like there could be something to the north, but... This isn't going off anymore. So, I don't know. Yeah, I'm not hearing it go off anymore. It looks like there's only three this time. I'm not seeing anything. Hmm. 
All right, I guess. Um. We'll see if there's any other side quests. I'll go inside the navel, but otherwise I think we're done here. Because that still benefit following me around, get all the side content. Yeah, I mean, if you're down, like, I'll probably play in, I don't know, like, an hour or so. I don't, I don't know if you plan to stay up or not. Um, but otherwise, this weekend I'll probably jam a bit more of it during the day. How is this game? Everyone you know is either playing this or Diablo 4 right now. This is just a much more fleshed out version of Breath of the Wild and then some. It's just, it is insane the stuff you can do in this game. Um, I mean, you'll see some of it shortly, but like the building aspect and the physics engine they have in it, it's, it's kind of crazy. Um, the quests are, are better. The bosses feel like traditional Zelda bosses as opposed to just the Ganon fight over and over again and the same Divine Beast sort of setup. Um, hang on, where's the navel? Like right now, it's just like, okay, it kind of looks the same because we're in the woods, but... Um, is there anything else here? No, okay. I think we're done here. Alright. Tell you what. Just for funsies, because I can, and I haven't done it yet, and I should. Um. Yes. Okay. You're having trouble sleeping anyway, so if you're still up when you, when I switch, you'd be down. All right. Yeah, I just wanted to get a couple of hours of this in. That's usually what I do. Um, but like, Oi! take this for example. This is like a quick little demo of what this game can do. It's like I can hit I can hit this like this to make it go on its own. Alright, or we can find a steering wheel part. And then you can do that. I mean I put it the wrong way, but you know. Of course I put the thing the wrong way, but you know what, it illustrates the freedom you have. I mean, if you want to be... ...creative, right? Like, you, you can do, you can do weird shit if you want. Oh, there's a Korok suit in here. Nice. Um, weapons as well work in a similar way, like you fuse shit together. It's like I've made an axe out of a sword and stone. Let's take this, just because we're just fucking around. All right. I've been trying to make a death machine, but you, I could make something like this and hit it. <laughs> Hang on. Oh, I can't wait to see how this goes. shines upon the land. The aimless spirits of slain monsters return to flesh. The world is 
threatened once again. Okay, so this is, this is probably not going to be great, but let's just... Okay, so you know, this is... Uh, I mean, okay. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> that's not what I was expecting it to do, but that's cool, I guess. Kind of made an arm of slots. Alright, just... Stop, sir, please. Okay. So, if you're making useless shit, yeah. I mean, there are more clever things you can do with it. Um, but arrows is another thing you can do. You can uh, just fuse stuff into it. So, if you want a fire arrow, for example, you attach a fire fruit. If you want an ice arrow, ice fruit, lightning, stun. There's just... You can... I can be stupid and just, like... You know, if I really wanted to... Like, shoot some meat. It lets you. Um, I'm not going to, but I can if I want to. Do I have Zap Shroom at all? That'll do. If I'm going to do what I'm going to do, I have to make this. Cool, shock resistance. Alright. Anyway, that was the reason I was doing that. Uh, but let me get one of my more creative vehicles out, just so you can see what you can do. So you get all, like, these are the parts you can find across the world, or you can get these capsules that provide them to you. So let me take out four of these, a steering wheel... Drop them on the ground. And then you can sort of, you know, you can go through your history. And the stuff that I've made, like there's my attempt at a, a death robot did not work. Um, I'll make a death machine one day, but let's take this. There we go. Now I have a vehicle, a good one. Better than the horse, yep. No, this is this is the mode of transfer. The one benefit the horse has is that you don't have to keep recreating it. The building reminds you of besieged. <laughs> and is this uh Is this what I think it is? Yeah it is. Alright, cool. Check this out. That's yep. So you know. Taluses now have this shit going on. Let's take this. Shoot the talus, and now the talus is on my side. <laughs> Get out of here. But, you know, if it throws something... We can reverse the flow of time on objects. Uh, but also do... Go through shit. Um, come on. Come on. Do it. Ah, oh, aimed at side on. Huh. 
So you can do that if you want. Get out of it. So the way weapons work in this game now is you have a base and then you kind of attach it to it. So I take this and then I take the talus heart and I can either attach it to the shield or the sword and then there we go. Stronger weapon. Where's my car? There it is. You can see there's stuff in the sky. But that's not what I came here to do. I've kind of been neglecting this one, but I think I'm capable now. Okay, here we go. Wish me luck. Loki afraid of fighting this one. But I think it's not bad now that I have health. I mean, just showing how better the fights are. Like, we saw a Talus from the previous game, but this is one of the new bosses. Spawn it. Oh, it's being tricky now. Not high enough. Last hit was last hit was last hit. I can't see it. There. I think that's all of them.
Okay. Uh, this one. Okay. Now this is where it's going to get annoying. Ooh, I'm almost out of arrows. Oh boy. This is going to be interesting. Honestly, I, I don't know what to do if I run out of arrows. Probably not go any higher. Okay, I'm gonna have to remove this bow just temporarily. Let this go to waste. This has to. <laughs> I have to. I have to do a lot of damage with it. there for a sec. I ran out of arrows. Anyway. I can tick that one off the list. Yeah, I need to buy more arrows. It's a lot of fun. What was that apple tree that I saw? Yeah, okay. Just an easy way to pick apples. Uh... Right, so there's the quest to follow the dragon now. I assume it's the dragon. Where is it? Uh, High Spring and the Light Rings. I still haven't gotten that one. Okay, so it's currently in Hebra. Assume it's the light dragon. <laughs> oh, I need, yeah, I need cold resist. Uh, okay, that'll do. So am I am I correct in this or hold on? Where is it currently? Oh shit. Well that's easy. I don't even have to do
Okay, assuming I can walk on it. Okay, I kind of lucked out here. Careful. Okay. Definitely want more of these. I have to go for a claw once I do try to get something from it. <laughs> a scale? Oh shit. It's a stamina thing. Shit. It's not health this time. I might not make it. I don't think I can do it. Come on, please just let it be two wheels. It's three wheels, isn't it? It's three fucking wheels. Oh, no, it's two wheels. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's a bit of a derpy face. <laughs> no, but I don't want to upgrade the champion to Nick, do I? I guess. This is cool. See, the only downside to this is I probably should have gotten the scales before the Master Sword, because I had a way of tracking the damn thing. But now, if the sword is gone, I don't. Which, maybe... Well, I guess I don't have a choice, huh? Oh, it's gonna do the health thing now, too? No? Okay. I don't have a, an inventory slot for this, so how's, how's this gonna... I mean, I, I kind of dig it, like, the rustic look to it. Link. Link. What? Speak. The master sword. Your sword. She is the key to destroying the demon king. He defeated her before. A long slumber will heal these grievous wounds. And when you two next face the Demon King... You will yeah, Faye's alive. Through her. Link, you are our final hope. I pray. Reaches you in the future.
This is a cool scene. Well, I don't have to look for a thumbnail. This this is fine. Da 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 da. Oh no! But I want no. <laughs> I want the dragon skin. Come back! Come back! Come back! Come back! Fuck's sake. <laughs> oh my god, I, I, I can't believe it. It's, it's just so annoying. Why did it do that? Could it not at least let me get the, the scale? There. <laughs> um, is that everything? Okay. Uh, I gotta hurry. Okay. Here we go. I'm gonna catch up to it. I'm getting the scale. I'm not leaving without it. Okay, we're good. Mission success! Just link, please, please land, S sir. Land, thank you. Good lord. Okay, hang on. Oh, I don't want this to go any worse. Did I get all the light? Did I get all the light things, or is this um? Is this it? <laughs> Shit. Oh. I don't see any more. I'll check just in case. Did I get the ones by the tail? Uh... <laughs> okay. Ugh. There better be something by the tail. Okay. <laughs> 
game, don't. By the tail. Stay on. There's nothing, there's nothing here. <laughs> I have a conniption if I fall off. Okay, I'm going to keep walking along this. But I didn't land on the tail last time. Like, I landed somewhere in the middle. That's why I, I kind of want to check. I, I, I think we're in the clear. All right. There's the scale. Yeah, mission, mission success. Fanfare music plays. <laughs> I had to. Where am I? I don't even know where this has led me to map-wise. Oh, we're in Central Hyrule, like, pretty much right outside the um, lookout landing. That's, that's pretty coincidental. Alright, let's, let's just land here, it's fine. Okay, it, it's been a it's been a while, but man, I have not worn this thing in such a long time. Wait, it doesn't have... Doesn't have the damage value this time? Interesting. You can fuse items to it. Oh. But even, I mean, even base weapons have, like, a, a damage value to it. I'm surprised this thing has not gone off yet. <laughs> the biggest surprise for me right now is this has not gone off yet. How is that possible? From what you heard, it's 30, but then 60 near gloom. I mean, that's matching what it was in Breath of the Wild before you would do Trial of the Sword. So, seems about right. That's not taking fusion into account. Kind of surprise. <laughs> it has yet to go off. I need to fuse something with gloom onto it. I have some Ganon parts.
Oh, here's a president I haven't completed. And the Korok seat, so. Two for the price of one. Flip it. Would this be accepted? Uh, I'm not sure. Seems a bit jank. Let's see if this accepted. Mm -hmm. That works. Oh. How's the president get that? Ah. <laughs> it's it's great that the mask is just wiggling as we're talking. Okay. Probably that tree. Yeah, I need arrows. Yeah, ha ha. I mean, I'm not gonna delve into Korok hunting just yet, but I'm gonna have the mask on at the very least. I haven't done. Would appear so. Oh. Yeah, okay. This just reminds me of the creation I made. <laughs> Tower Town. Oh, man. I made some dumb things in my life, but I think that one's up there. Ah! I need an arrow. Unless I can throw the stick at it. Maybe. 
There's probably an arrow in one of these. There we go. We're fine. We got three. Wait, really? In the cave? Or it's above me. I don't think I've ever seen a Korok in a cave. Let's see what it says. Yeah, it's above me. That's fine. One jump. There we go. Yeah. One more off another upgrade. While I am here, since I can, More flight time. It's pretty much what it equates to. Container, please. Thank you. Oh, what's this? Uh, spot, where'd you get off to, Spot? Uh, well, look who it is. I sure can't thank you enough for helping our mini stable come together. Uh, Heard me talking my, to myself, did you? Spot is the name of my beloved horse, you see. Truth be told, he's missing. Ran away just before the stable was built. Well, he's always been a meek horse, so I can't imagine he's run off too far. He's beautiful. Just one look at his silky beige coat and you'll know it was him. You'd recognize him with his unique gray dappling, too. That's the reason I call him Spot in the first place. A horse like him, I bet he's someplace with a nice view, taking in the sights. Just wish I didn't have so much trouble climbing to high places these days. Spotting Spot, what a nice quest name. Let 
mean, we can, we can deal with that later. Okay, uh... I mean, in terms of goals, really... Okay, I guess we got Hylia and... If I'm taking it area by area, like, we're almost heading to the Gerudo area. Go, go, Power Rangers! I saw this, uh... Well, it was on Twitter, but, like... A TikTok of this dude that got a letter of complaint from his landlord. That, uh, a neighbor complained that they were hearing loud sex sounds. Or inappropriate sounds, I guess. And he was confused. Until he thought about it. And then it clicked that he had been playing um, Tears of the Kingdom since release. And the loud sex noises that uh, the neighbor was hearing and complained about wasn't sex at all, but was actually the, the sounds of um, him upgrading gear at this particular ferry. So the walls were thin enough that they could hear the sounds of this ferry, and they mistook it as, uh, yeah... Naughty time. So in honor of that. <laughs> you just can't look at this. Oh dear. Like they should have known. I probably should have done the uh, the other one, but it's okay. I'll do both. <laughs> Such a weird thing. They couldn't just, uh, I don't know. Just have the first animation with the blowing of the air, that was enough. Oh, I probably should have checked all the stuff. Hang on. <laughs> God. What have I? What else have I got? I can do light pants now, so that's good. Get that to the same baseline. Um, otherwise, I don't really have anything else I want to upgrade yet. That needs two light scales, right, okay. Because that one I do find myself using. Oh, 
I, I can buy both of these. Wow! <laughs> I don't think I can buy anything else. Let's see. I have 80 of... No, I have 30 of these. It's the other way around. Half-ish. Uh, oh shit. Can you hang on for like 30 seconds, chat? Hang on, I'll be back real quick. Alright, sorry, I had some leftovers that <laughs> I was gonna fridge, and I just wanted it to cool down, and then I forgot to do it, but it's all good. It's done. Ugh. Yeah. <laughs> it just clicked, I was like, oh shit, right. <laughs> oh. Oh. How did I not notice you, or did I mess this one up? Where's your friend? On the hill, right? Of course it is. But see, this this is simpler now because I have tested and the flying machine does work. Those are my favorites. Okay. I mean, I probably could have done it when I took, like, another break, but... Better safe than sorry. Not let it wait too long. gonna tip over. It's because of the Korok. It's not balanced. Yeah, I need to straighten out the Korok. There we go. No, can't be that. Like, it has to be the perfect little hood ornament, otherwise it's not going to work. Okay. 
Okay, there we go, 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 there we go. Oh my god, it flips so easily. Well, let's bring it back to its starting point. It's fine. I need to reach my friend! <laughs> You're fine. It's just, it's easy, it's easier said than done. Nah, no, that's a fail. I, f I think it needs to be, I need to be further back and kind of have like a, a lead in for it. Here we go. As long as it gets up there, it doesn't matter where. Close, close enough. Close enough. Alright, I'll just fly it a little bit further. Man, ah, uh, damn it. I got it. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Oh shit, too far. Stop. Wrong button. Ugh. Perfect. That was... I stuck that landing. Oh, this is bad. I probably could have just walked it over there by now. I need to reach my friend. Yeah, it's fine. Is over there. I'm gonna go chase Farosh. Okay, I need a, I need a land here. That's a good landing. Good, good landing. Look at that. All right, wait for the recharge. Okay, go. Shit. 
shit. Costs. It's a fine. I need to get its claw. Okay, land here. That's fine. Okay, give it a minute, give it a minute, give it a minute. Working. Hit this thing like got it. Okay. Down there. Where'd it go? I don't see it. Oh, there. Jeez, scared me for a sec. All good. Now, where's my air bike? Possible that it landed nearby. Ah, oh, ha ha! Hello. How's it going? I guess we can do this shit, huh? Oh shit, he's got a two-hander. Whoa. I've never seen this before. Okay, look. At this point, we should be wearing... all this. There we go. Much better. Stuck it. Loom Club. I didn't read what it said. Can I say? Gradually went down the bot. Uh, same, same thing. How much do dark clumps do? One attack power, yeah. The bow, I think, is the best part about this. The bow is awesome. Yeah, I doubt my flying machine is still intact. Anyway. Wait, why'd I mark that? Oh, because something fell from the sky. Yeah, yeah, yeah.
Oh, right, and back to... The Yahaha mask. Okay, let's finally... That's all of them. Thank you, devout swordsman. I have sent a measure of my strength to the Mother Goddess statue. For this pious deed, I shall bestow upon you a small blessing. With your aid, a measure of our strength has gone to restore the Mother Goddess's statue who dwells in the Bass Canyon. Should you make a pilgrimage there in tribute... Oh, you should make a pilgrimage there in tribute. I will do that now. Nice to fast travel, I know. <laughs> it's just something. Honestly, have an experience. Nice to wear clothing. Nice to try out different armors and everything, because it's something that I never really did. Oh, it's back. It's all sparkly. Devout swordsman who offers his prayers, I am deeply grateful for the aid you have provided to the statues of the springs. In recognition of your wisdom, power, and courage, I would like to present you a sword. Kindly organize your belongings so that another sword may fit among them. Uh, yeah, that's fine. No. Yeet, yeet that thing. The white sword of the... A sword said to have belonged to the hero of the sky. Oh, this is like... This is the Skyward Sword. This is the Skyward Sword sword. This is before Fee. And this is Fee. Well, I guess... No, it's still Fee. Cool. Got from some tentacle on. Ah, okay, no worries. Uh, I guess let me orient myself as to where I want to go next, because I do want to play a bit of Diablo, and this has been going for about two hours and a half almost. So. You know what? I never, I never solved this. What, what was it? It was, hang on, let me go to the adventure log. It's a shrine quest. At the spring of wisdom near the summit of Mount Laneru, skim across snow from the spring high in the heavens to the mountain below. Pass through the rings of light. Oh. Spring in the heavens. That's why I didn't figure it out, because it's in the sky. Right, so what's directly above Lanero? That. Right, so it's this. Um go here. Got it. This'll be easy. I thought it was a snowboarding thing. <laughs> I, I just misread it. Yep. Okay, so we're headed. I 
pretty much in that direction. Is it higher or is it lower? It might be higher. Let's see. Mm, it's not... It's not bad, is it? I mean, it could be. It does have a spr... Does it have a hot... Yeah, it has a spring. They both do. Alright, let's just make a flying machine. Kind of low on stuff. I'll use these. These are kind of pointless. Should be a uniform thing though. Nah, I fucked that up. That's a that's a good auto save. Okay. Try again. Not that. Shit. Okay, I guess I may as well cook something. Um. Takeoff was too rough. There we go. Better. Okay, I can see there's two. There's a shrine over there. I need to get more charges. I've, I've used a lot of Zonite charges. We'll have to go farm them. Called. Oh shit. Bail. It's fine. As long as I made it up here. Oh, there's another one up here anyway. We're good. So what is this?
Okay, that's fine. I'll wait. I'll be patient. Come on. I will save, since I'm up here. Wow, it really does not want to let me get this. <laughs> Come on! Unbelievable how particular this has been. I can't jump up yet. <laughs> it's not at a height. Come on! Can I shoot it? I've never shot one before. I feel like it's the answer is no. It just refuses... Okay, it's gone. Fuck me, then. Um, let me save. Just in case I mess something up. Okay. So what is... I don't think this is it, otherwise I'd be able to see it. Anyway, let's make another one of my flying machines. Oh wow, it does work. You can do that. That's neat. Saved just in case. It's fine as long. Yeah, okay. Yeah, this is one because there's a. Uh... Should be fine to do like this. Just take the damage. Oh shit. Okay, now... Now we'd be snowboarding. It was snowboarding! Okay, 
good. I just had completely forgotten about this one, but there we go. I made this look easy, really? <laughs> I don't know. Ah, oh, I'm not even worthy. Yeah, I mean, as long as you don't give up and keep trying and you're having fun, it doesn't matter. Ascension. Guess I know what it wants me to do. Whoa. Shit. Come back. It's just not... Okay, it does nothing. Don't, don't bother with that. Um, that one's fine. Okay. There's only one tough enemy, really. Where's the bat? I want your bat. Where's your bat? I don't know where the bat dropped. I really wanted that bat. There it is. I mean, what I had wasn't bad, actually, either. Oops. 
See ya. Okay, that killed it. And now... It's a shame I won't get to pick up that fruit. Yeah. Would have been nice. Wow, that's that's a good reward. Uh yeah, I get rid of that. Decent. Glad this one's done. Just completely forgot about it, to be honest. <laughs> just, just a little bit. Okay. I think this is good for today. For Zelda, that is. Uh, I'm gonna take a short two minute intermission. I'm gonna stretch for a bit. Get another drink, and then I'm just gonna play a little bit of Diablo just to close off the evening. But if you're here watching Zelda, yeah, thanks for uh, tuning in. Hope you enjoyed. Or if you're watching later on YouTube, thanks for sticking around to the end, and uh, yeah. Hope you too enjoyed and consider clicking buttons for algorithm purposes. One second. Fucking Nadra. Interrupting my outro. I don't think I'm going to make it in time. Uh, but yeah, no, I, I do appreciate people that have been doing that. It does help. Um, that's why a lot of YouTubers say it. Okay, good. <laughs> I was worried that wasn't going to hit. Okay, I did get it. Okay. I, I just... Fuck me then, huh? Could have been worse. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Thanks for watching. This is where the bot ends for YouTube. Bye, YouTube. <laughs>